Hello everybody and welcome back to Prison Architect. Today we're gonna go right at it because there are a couple of things that we want to do. We want to extend uh, to the medium security as well. And we also need to get some protective custody in here too. So what we're going to do, we're gonna start out straight away, is we're gonna extend the holding cell. We're just gonna make the holding cell bigger. The reason we're going to do that is obviously, there you go, we're just going to get rid of that. It requires an entrance. Um, there will be an entrance, but not right now, because if we do that, these people will probably escape. And that's not what we want to have happen at all. So we're going to do that. We're going to extend up there. We also are, or at least this is what I want to do. I want to uh, rearrange the kitchen a little bit, because this kitchen at the moment is honestly a bit of a shithole. And I want to change that about. So we're going to dismantle all of this. And we're going to be quick about that, because obviously we can't lose the kitchen for too long. Now, there are a couple of workers out there, the cops, or well, the guards, I should say, they're not really cops, they're guards, are obviously trying to let them all in. It isn't always going as well as it should be, or in the tempo that it should be. Right, so they're getting at that. So now we're going to get some cookers in. Right, we've got, we've already got the one fridge, which we're going to replace at some point. But I want to do this a little bit differently, because I, don't, I feel like we're not using the space of this thing properly. So we've got two cookers. Uh, we're going to have to check. This is the back side of it. So we're going to get a cooker there. Right? And we're going to get a cooker right there. Then we're going to turn it around and get another cooker right there. This just leaves us with so much more space around the entire area, which is just what we want, honestly. So we're going to get a fridge up there, and we're going to get another fridge up there. And then if we want to expand, we have a whole lot more space, like down here, which we can use so much better. So that's one thing that I want us to do. Obviously, they're working on this now. It seems like this could be safe, so we are actually going to dismantle, uh, or demolish, I should say, um, these walls right there. Demolish those. And actually dismantle, which is now the right word, I should be using this bench uh, right there. So that's all working out fantastic, this. I have also have an idea for this, right? So we're going to do that. We're going to dismantle these sinks as well. And then we're going to demolish this wall right there. And what we're going to do instead is we're going to make the wall there. And I'm going to explain this at some point. Actually, I'm thinking I'm thinking we could keep these. I'm thinking we could keep these walls right there. It, it might actually fit. So um, we're going to do something uh, a little bit luxurious, possibly. Uh, we're still dismantling this, though. That's still right, these two. Uh, we're going to expand on this, and it's going to be amazing. We already have one of the most um, fantastic staff rooms you'll ever see in your lifetime. Uh, but we're going to make it even better. But that's all something. We're going to do everything at, at the same time. So the holding cell is going to expand. It's going to be all the way over there. We've got another holding cell. Uh, when it comes to... Do we want to get, like, another toilet in? I think another toilet would be... Uh, actually, no. Not another toilet. We're fine the way it is. What we, we do want to get, though, is another light. For sure. Now... Uh, what we could do, obviously, we're going to plan this out a little bit. There is going to be... This is the entrance to uh, uh, minimum security, as you all know. Minimum security entrance will be right here. So we'll get, like, a, a thing that goes to medium security. We'll get, like, something in between. I'm not sure what and how and why, but we'll figure that out. I mean, I do know why. That's the only thing I don't know. Other than that, I'm not sure. So this will be the entrance. I'm still not sure how exactly we're going to do this. Um, we're just going to... Make this into like a block. It's going to be protective custody. Protective custody needs to be big enough for everyone, but not like too huge. Um, there should be an intake. Or do we already have an intake? I'm not sure. There's 10 minimum security guys coming in in 23 hours. I mean, we're making money again, so that's a good thing. Everything, that all seems to be working fantastically. Um, the holding cell, I mean, do we, I do, do we want to like replace these toilets, get them in a different area? I don't know. Maybe we would like to do that. Maybe that's something we might look at later. Not now. We'll figure it out at some point. Um, so the entrance will just be right here. We'll get like the entrance. And this will be um, the place where we are going to go. So uh, well, how are we going to do this? We need to fit. Somehow we need to fit everything for protective custody in here. Now it doesn't need to be exact. Oh, there we go. There's the intake. Uh, now we don't need to obviously get everything and everyone in here. That's not necessary. However, uh, everything... A lot as possible, at the very least. As much as possible. So, what we want to do, for sure, is we'll get a hallway going. Like this. And then, I think protective custody... I mean, I don't know if dorms are the way to go there. Because dormitories with protective custody 
you think that won't be a good idea, but I don't think like it matters. Protective custody, you have from minimum security, but you also have like maximum security. They're all going to go into protective custody if there are snitches or something. And I don't want to have those end up together. So we're going to have to go with one person cells. Now, obviously, those are this size, I think. Or what uh, was it? An, one more. I'm not sure. I'm thinking this is one cell. A cell needs to be two by three. So this is two by two. That's not big enough. Um, so it needs to be two wide and three long. So it needs to be one longer, uh, which sh should be not not. Uh, what, what is this? Can we get rid? Please, just thank you. So it will be right there instead. This will be the cell, uh, and we'll get a couple of these. We'll get a whole lot of these because players custody. I mean, right now it doesn't look like we need a lot, and to be fair, we don't. At some point, there'll be shitloads of them. They just won't. They won't stop. They just won't stop. And then there's one awkward little fucking space again. I just cannot stand the fact that it's there. It annoys me the bits. Okay, let's try to do that differently then. Right? We're gonna do it the other way around. Let's try, see if we can fix this. So this is one cell, got another. And we'll just see how this how this turns out, right? We'll just see what we can make of this. No, I'm, I'm fucking shit at this already. Why the hell, stop doing that! It's just ruining my life, this fucking game. Right, there we go. And we'll just make something out of this, I guess, and then We'll close this off and then I don't know get a, maybe one door I know I don't want to get dorms in here so um, we could use this space for could we get solitaries in there we, we can't get like all the solitaries in there that's not gonna fit unfortunately so we can get two solitary cells in there which I think might be enough to be honest so we got one two three four five six seven place for uh, protective custody at the moment which might not be enough, let's be honest, but this is the thing we're going to try anyway. We're going to get the entrance right there. Um, then there will be a canteen. I don't know. I, maybe we want to get it from the same kitchen because, again, we can expand on this. There are people working in this kitchen now as well. So I'm thinking we want to get it from the same kitchen. So we're going to get the canteen area. Uh, and then need all different other areas as well because protective custody needs to be on its own. So we're going to get the canteen area, which will be like in here. It's not going to be like a big area, but this will be the canteen, I guess. So this is for... This is four. I guess this is the middle. You know what? It's not the middle. This will be the middle. This three and three. I mean, fuck, I'll just get one then. Oh, that's a bit too small. Okay, fuck it. We'll get a big entrance. I don't care. So this will be the canteen. And then over here, we have spaces to get all of their other crap. Um, Do they need a shower room? I think we could give them a shower like, right here in a bed in the toilet. I think we could work. It's going to be a little bit cramped. I don't, I'm not sure. I mean, because of custody, again, we don't want to get them together as much as we have to. Like, especially not in, like, a big shower room where there's not enough supervision. So I'm not sure how to do that. Uh, we're going to have to get a shower room in there. That much seems obvious. Um, okay, so maybe we can get, like, a shower room right there. This can be like, the, you walk in here and there's showers, and that's going to be like a shower room, and then there'll be like something else in beneath here, and then this will be the canteen. Maybe that's an option. I'm not sure if it is. We're going to have to try and see if it works, though. Uh, and then this can be, let's see what rooms we still need and what we don't have. We, so we need, we're going to get the, the ca canteen. Uh, we're obviously going to have to need a yard as well. So... I mean, maybe not. Maybe not a yard quite as much. Maybe maybe we'll just get, like... Okay, this will be just, like, a altogether nice little area. So it's not going to be, like, all too amazing, but it's going to be fine, I suppose. So when it comes to logistics, we've got the jobs and all that stuff working. Uh, not deployment. That's not what I'm looking for either. We need to make sure that this is min-sec only, though. I want that to be clear. That should be min-sec only, and it should be min-sec only. Um, reception, blah, 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 blah. This is staff only. That should be... Pretty fucking sure. This is not necessarily staff only. This is not staff only. This is all. There's no pa uh, parent only, so that doesn't work. And um, this is all okay. For now, I think that's fine. Uh, we'll we'll see about this later. First of all, I'm not sure if we even have. We don't have like known reputations at all, so we're not really sure about this. Which is why we probably want to get intelligence in there. So he's going to research intelligence because I think that's really nice. I don't think micromanage... Fuck it. We'll get micromanagement. I don't even know exactly what it does, but we'll get it. Legal. Uh, we don't have to put our time to do that. Garbage recycling might be something we might look, want to look into. Dental contract. I mean, it's all our money, so right now I'm not sure. Um, she's already research. Actually, actually uh, she could be researching health. Health is something we want to get in as well, so we're going to get health. Oh, God. It's instantly going wrong. What the fuck? Why did this happen? 
What? Oh god. No, they have two medium security now because they fucked up. Did they kill someone? Or they tried to kill someone? We don't exactly know why. We don't know what the fuck happened there. That was so weird. But I, I don't think we have any snitches. Or at least we have not found anyone to be a snitch or an ex-law enforcement as of yet. No one has been attacked, so that's fine. Uh, we do have some people in here, which is good. Uh, a preacher, unknown reputation, unknown. I mean, we don't know an awful lot yet, let's be honest. We don't know of any snitches or ex-law enforcement or anything like that. We have no clue about them, let's be honest. Even the amazing psychologist office, which office is just absolutely fucking great, isn't it? It's so good. Um, we have no clue. Uh, but we'll figure that out at some point. So what am I gonna do right now, right? The toilets are no longer available. And that, my friends, is a problem. So we're going to demolish... Uh, there you go. Find the button. We're going to demolish this right there. It's gonna be the opening into the toilets. And this is gonna be the sinks. And what we're gonna give them is... This is gonna be amazing, right? You'll be blown away by this. Actually, let's just plan out first, see if it works. Because that's important. Oh, it does work. Oh, that's great. We're gonna give them showers as well. I'm thinking that these guys deserve showers, okay? I think they do. And then this is just like a random hallway thing that no one knows how to exactly use or do something with. And then we're gonna get showers in here, right? So we're gonna get doors in there. We're gonna get some doors. And we're gonna get showers. My people are going to get showers and they're gonna fucking love it. So there you go. And we want some utilities. We wanna get water running through over there as well. Great, so get your ass moving on that, so our people are going to get some showers, which is fantastic. Um, there's a lot of blood over here, a lot of problems here. Sanya, which of course is a football player as well, which is quite funny. Uh, we don't have any way to heal them, so these people are probably going to die. That could be a problem, because we don't have any way to heal them as of now. That is a problem. Um, I mean, I do want to build this. But I feel the need for medium security at this moment is a tiny bit higher. As well as getting a health facility in at some point, because we're getting towards that as well. Um, this could be a little bit of an issue. Are the cook? I'm, I'm gonna hire another cook as well, because I think we're getting more and more people in. They could definitely use an extra bit of help. And I don't think another janitor would hurt, hurt us an awful lot either, because there are a lot, there's a lot of shit in this prison, let's be honest. It's really ridiculous. So we're gonna plan out medium security. Uh, the entrance will be... Uh, there will be one small door just like we've done over there and it will lead into a hallway again i'm i'm not sure how or how exactly we're going to do it but we will do it that's all i know so uh, we're going to start off with something like this something in here at the very least it's going to be a door um can we fit cells in here that's not enough for a cell no it's too small so that's not going to work out, unfortunately. If only that worked out, that would have been amazing. But it doesn't, so we're going to have to figure out something out, something a little bit differently. So this is going to be such a waste of space, so we're not doing that. I don't think that will work. Uh, I do want to keep that one. Thank you very much. Um, so we're going to get the door. I mean, is, it, is, is there a middle here? We've got seven, so we can get three, and then the door, and three. That works. So this is the middle. Uh, we're going to get a hallway in there. I'm thinking, because we want to get something in between. I don't want this to be connected up. There was, must be something like in between where you can ho host some guards, maybe get like a secret entrance or something that only the guards can actually get to. I think that might be a good idea, just something that they can like walk in between. I'm not sure how I'm going to do it. Maybe something over here, like a, a locked guard door or something that just is not allowed in here. We just want to get something like a little space in between that will probably drag all the way up to here. Maybe we'll go lower. I'm not sure. There's if it's going to be a building, or it's going to be the facility where we're going to hold our medium security. Now, I'm not sure how we're going to do this quite yet. Uh, medium security, obviously, is a whole different bunch, and we're going to have to pay attention to them because they're dangerous. Uh, I'm not sure how we're going to do it. This is probably going to be one of their cells, and we're just going to have to go like that. I guess we're just going to have to keep going. And make a lot of these cells, because we want a couple of them in here, but not too much. Because obviously, uh, these guys will probably need their own kitchen, and will probably need all of their own stuff. I'm not sure. I always used to give everything and everyone their own little kitchen. For now, the entire prison is running on this central kitchen. Which I think is fine, because medium and the parents and the protective custody uh, guys can work together quite well. Why is this not connected? To oh, it's not done yet. Still being laying down. He's gonna fix it. He's gonna actually fix the showers. God. Can we also... Oh, no, he's going to actually get the crate. Oh, thank you. Thank God he did it. Look at that. We've got showers in our fucking break room or whatever. 
So, uh, wait, deployment wise, we want this to be staff only. Staff only, staff only, staff only, staff only. This is all staff only. That should be freaking clear. God, look at that. We've got an amazing canteen. We've got an amazing staff room. They've got some offices down here as well. It's a huge toilet with lots of space and they can even take a shower. If they feel like it, they can take a fucking shower just then and there and then. Can you even believe that? And then we're going to get like a little bin. Uh, I don't know. Where could we get? Probably like in the corner right here. We're going to get a little bin just for the sake of it because it looks nicer. Then we're going to get a sofa in there. That will be a bit weird. Well, I would like to fix this with something. Get something in there because it's a bit, it's a bit boring, isn't it, at the moment? Maybe a table. Just because I don't fucking know. Or we can just get another sink in. I'm not sure what we want to do here. Uh, we want to get something there because it's just, it's a boring sh nothingness right now. Maybe an electrical radiator. Nah, uh, that's not it either. A small bench. Oh, we've got small benches. That's pretty cool. I didn't even know that. We do, apparently. So let's just get two small benches in there. Don't know why we would do that, but we are going to do that. And don't question me. It's my authority. I have decided that's what we're going to do. Um, oh, God. This is, a, this is a problem. This is really problematic. The holding cell is full of people. Um, all of the available cells are too high quality. What do you mean by that? What do you mean they're too high quality? Your minimum security. Why is it too high quality for you? Just go in the fucking dorm. Why can't these people go? These dorms are empty now. Or at least I think that it is free time. So some people are in their dorms. Others are walking around and eating a bit more. No one is in the yard. Um, because apparently the yard isn't good enough for the bunch of pricks. Well, the more you know. Let's just go on planning and ignore everything that's happening over there. It's no longer important. So medium security we are building. Medium security is going to be quite the thing to make. Um, lots of things here. Lots of ways to go. Um, there'll be the entrance there, and then over here, maybe we can connect it up with something else. I'm not sure what and how. Probably, like, this could be, like, a shower room. We could do that. Yeah, we can make this into, like, a shower room and fix that up and just make sure that they all have a nice little shower they can go to. Well, it's not that little, actually. It's a huge shower room, if we're honest. Uh, but that's fine, you know. That's okay. So we're going to get this as a shower room. It's going to be nice and open. We want people to be able to see in there. When I say people, I mean the guards, especially the guards. Uh, probably only the guards, who are the only people we want to actually ha be able to see in there. Uh, this is going to be quite big. Uh, I'm not going to lie about that. Uh, this is probably enough for a cell, isn't it? Three. Yeah, that should be enough. So this is what we're going to build for now, at the very least. So I connected up over there. This is going to be quite a big building anyway. Like, my God, this is going to be quite fancy. Uh, we're going to make it all happen. Right. And then the line is drawn right there. So we're just going to do this. We're just going to make it work. Uh, lots of guys are going to be in here. Like, my god, it's going to be ridiculous. I'm not sure how exactly we're going to fix all of it. Uh, there's going to be, like, a big hallway in between. Lots of space. So not everyone's, like, all cramped up because I don't like it when that, when that happens. Uh, so this is going to be, like, the cell. Um, how all of the other things are going to be as of now, I am not sure quite yet. Um, maybe what we want to do is just do something like this. And I like, get the entrance in there as well with like a, a big door and then get like a canteen and a kitchen back here. That could be a thing. Uh, what would actually be preferable is uh, a kitchen of the kitchen personnel being able to get in. Actually, that's what we're probably going to do. We're going to make this into the kitchen and this will be the canteen. I'm thinking that might be better. But that's going to be a small... I think we're going to have to leave a couple of these cells out though. And then this is going to be the canteen. I'm thinking yes. I'm thinking that's the way to go. So we're going to have to do all this and then get like... Yeah, we're going to do it like that. That's the way we're going to be. So there's going to be a canteen. There's going to be the kitchen. And this is going to be like a little in-between area that only the staff can use. Uh, which are actually going to get a staff room. Uh, or no, a jail door. Or staff room. Staff door. I'm not sure about that yet. Um, how about their yard and all of that crap, though? Uh, probably down here. We're probably going to get their yard uh, connected up down here. I'm thinking that might be a good idea. So we're just going to plan that out as well. It's going to be the entrance. And this is going to be... There you go. This is going to be it. This is going to be the yard. Um, the psychologist is actually going to have a window looking right up to their yard. Um, so I hope they don't mind about that. Maybe I should not do that and get like a fence around it? I'm not sure. Um, but that's the way it's going to be. This is going to be the yard. So, starting off with that, we're going to get a fence. And we're going to get a fence all around this area. And all around this area right there. That's going to be the yard. And then this is going to be an entire building. And that's going to be pretty fucking expensive, I'm sure. It's 11,000 bucks. Uh, it's probably well going to be worth it. So we're going to get a jail door uh, in there. We're just going to connect all of that up. And we're also, we're going to get a staff door in here, 
which is going to connect this up and make sure that the staff can get into um, the kitchen, which will be have another door to, like, right over here somewhere. We'll figure out all of that out later. For now, they're going to work on that, though. Is anyone going to use the shower? I'm really curious about whether they're going to use the shower. Now, we're going to get a little light bulb in here because it's too dark for my liking. Um, now that we have the cash, I'm tempted to just clone the offices and place these as well. It's only like 420 bucks, which is really funny. Really, honestly. Uh-huh. Have a laugh about it. So we just have those filled up as we want to fill them up at some point because research is going to allow us to get more people in. We are... I mean, they're... She's taking... Oh, she's of course, she's researching something else as well. Intelligence, I guess. So maybe now we're going to work on health. Why is she not... Oh, she's working on micromanagement, of course. That's why health is not working. So we have intelligence in here, uh, which is a good thing. Uh, so, but in order to get intelligence, I think we need a security room. Uh, we also have laundry and all that stuff now. So that's something that we might want to invest into as well. Um, I'm not sure how and what and why. I'm not sure how we're going to do that. Medium security is not going to get an awful lot more. Even though I think that might be the perfect job for them. I think medium security is going to be a whole bunch of them. So I think it's better. Like Minimum security, you can't rely on them anyway. Because they'll be gone in like two, three, maybe four, five years. That's the max they're going to be in this place. Because after that, they're going to be disappeared because they're free. So I'm thinking the majority is uh, of the people that actually work in this place are going to have to be minimum or probably minimum security. Because mi maximum security is, might be a little bit too risky. Medium security, they are risky, but they're not as bad. They're here for a longer amount of time. We're taking 10, 12, 20 years. So they can do the laundry, you know, they can do the mail room in the library and, you know, all of that stuff. So that's amazing. Uh, we also need a security room now at some point, which is definitely something of importance. I'm not sure where. Maybe we can get that, like, back here behind the uh, psychologist's office. That might be an option. I uh, might have to think about doing that because we, we want to get a security room in there. We want to make all of that work. So there's going to be a kitchen over here. Um... Or maybe we could get, like, a secret security room, like, behind in this little alleyway. That might be funny. I'm not sure if we want to do that, though. But it might be, like, a really funny little thing that we can make. Actually, we're the, when it's done... Actually, I, have pl I haven't I have let this out free. And that's a problem, because I should have been doing that. So, that's a problem. Um, I want to bulldoze the foundations in this entire area right here. Because we don't want that right there. So we're going to have to do that once this is done. Well, God damn it, we fucked it. Or what well, I did. I should not blame you guys for my mistakes. Um, do we also want to do the protective custody thing? I'm not sure. We're going to get our uh, 20 grand because there's going to be lots of new capacity in there. So that's great. Uh, we need to research creative accounting as well as building an accounting office, which is something that we need to do at some point. So this is now completed, which is great, which means that we can now delete this because I didn't mean for there to be a foundation right there. I'm tremendously sorry about that. <laughs> I fucked up. Um, I'm thinking we might as well, again, now that we have the money, we might just as well clone these and get these cells working too. And do the same thing over here. Just spend a bit of cash on it, but make that work. Obviously, we didn't clone the fucking jail doors, I just only noticed, so we might want to do that right now. Look, at should have sort of reaction. Like, oh my god, there's going to be more of those fuckers in here. Why the hell? Oh, look, they're doing it. Great job, guys. Amazing. So this is going to be the entrance, this is going to be outside, and this is going to be the kitchen area. So, we want to get all of the walls in here, for sure. Uh, right there, and then we'll get the door, like, in there. That'll be fine. We're going to get a wall all the way up here. We're going to get the wall in here, and in here. And we're going to make two cells, so we can just copy these two uh, down if we want to. So, we're going to do that. So, what I want to check out now is utilities, because, again, now that we have the money... Yeah, that was just what I thought. We might as well spend a couple grand um, just getting more capacitors in because otherwise we might be in for a little bit of an issue with our electricity capacity, which we obviously don't want to happen. There's still someone unconscious in this thing, which is not great. Um, health is coming there. Uh, we don't have the... I mean, I don't have the space to make it at the moment, so I'm not sure how I'm going to do that. Maybe we can get like a, a working facility up in here next to Protective Custody who might be able to join in too. I'm not sure. We'll leave this open for now, the whole protective custody thing. Um, I think maybe we want to go and get it in there because these guys obviously want to have to go there and be able to work. So that's something that we want to do. 
They're building the walls right there, so we're gonna uh, fast forward a little bit. They're still destroying this now as well. So maybe now that we've planned this out, as soon as this wall is standing, we can plan out like a little security office that might be handy. Because an, a security office is gonna be really cool. So we're gonna get like a security office in there, I'm thinking. Actually, I'm kidding. We're gonna make this bigger. Because we want a big security office. There's gonna be a lot of security in here. Or maybe actually we get this entire in-between area. Like just say fuck it and just like... There's just be this is the only small alleyway. I mean that just makes no sense because I've, I just deleted the off. I mean <sighs> I'm sorry that I'm such an idiot, but I feel like this is the way I want to do it. I finally figured it out Maybe maybe I'm not okay. Fuck it. I'm, I'm gonna I'm lying. I'm not sure. I'm not sure what I want I need to think about this better fine. You know, okay. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind. Never mind We're gonna keep it as this for now keep it as it is for now. I think I also just fucked up the schedule. God damn it. No. I mean, it doesn't make, make an awful lot of difference, but no. Keep it the way it is for now. It's fine. For now. But I'm not sure about the future. God damn it, I don't know. Um, so we want a normal door in here. I mean, just make it a staff door. Why the fuck do I care? And that's going to be a kitchen. And then there's, there'll be cells in here, which we're going to have to make. And um, they're still working on that, though. I've ordered them to do that, right? Yeah, I was pretty sure that I ordered them to do that. But we might, we might as well make the objects now as well. So we're going to get jail door and jail door. Um, there will be... Um, le toilet, the, the toilet will be right there, uh, around the corner. I mean, I'm gonna give him that li little bit of privacy, and then we'll get the bed. I mean, do we want to do it like, I've never done it like this. Fuck it, we're doing it like this. This is new for me as well, but I kind of dig it. And then we could maybe fit in a chair next to the bed as well, or like, no, actually, no, that we, we, we can't and we won't. We won't do that, this is all they're getting. They're gonna be like the boring... Annoying cells that they are and that's all they're gonna get maybe a little window to their neighbors like hey How are you doing and then they kill him with like a fork or something they just stole out of the canteen I'm not sure all of those things are optional. Uh, what do you think about that? Is anyone using the showers yet? They're all going in there to the toilets. I mean, he's actually just cleaning up a food tray. What a nice guy you are You should be promoted. I'm just saying I mean maybe at some point I, I, I'll think about it They've got showers. They don't seem to want to use it they're not ready to use the showers, um, which is fair enough. They've got all of these amazing areas and spaces. God, I'm actually jealous of their, of, of their places. They're so amazing. We can make an armory as well. Group therapy. We've got dogs, surveillance, life discipline. Um, maybe this is a, mo a little mod content. I mean, it's only 1500 bucks. Might as well go for it and see what it's like. We've got a bank loan. We've got legal. Uh, groundskeeping. I mean, we'll save all of those things for next time. For later. For now... We've got quite the idea of what we want, and we've quite done all of these things quite nicely. There are maybe are a little bit... We need... Okay, we're going to get two more workmen, actually. We're going to go to ten. Um, because we, we, we've we blasted through, like, four fucking 30 grand in this episode. It's ridiculous. <laughs> but I love it. It's great. So, um, what we want to do... This will be the kitchen again, so we'll make this into uh, Le Kitchen. Uh, obviously, this window is now quite a bit of a disappointment. We're, we're going to dismantle that window. Uh, and we're gonna get it back at some point because he deserves his window just not there next to the kitchen And I have him smell all the nasty shit that they feed the prisoners all day long. Don't want to do that to the poor guy um, We're gonna get the canteen. This will be their canteen right in here uh, Yeah, this will be fine. So there you go This will be the canteen. This will be cells as we know. This is a cell. This is also a cell just want you to be um, aware by the fact. Uh, we're going to lay this huge fucking thing all the way down to the bottom. And making that work. Then we're going to get pipes all through the kitchen. I'm not sure where we're going to get stuff in this kitchen. But we're just going to fucking, fucking use it and see where it goes. Um, the toilets are um, there. So this is where the toilets are. So we're going to have to do this in every single fucking cell in order for this to work. We also need to give, to give these guys a shower room before we can actually make it work. So there's still a lot of investments to be made. Uh, we're going to see how all of that goes. Because we are running out of money slowly but steadily. We're still, we still all good to go. And there's still a lot of things that we want to do. Uh, but maybe I need to think about a couple of things a bit more. Actually, it's, it's there. We should do it properly. Thank you. This is where the toilets will be. Open that door. Thank you very much. Is there someone marching in the holding cell? Do we have a guard patrol in the holding cell? We don't. Uh, we might want to get deployment. Deployment might be a good thing. You can 
I mean, he's already doing life discipline, so he can't do deployment at the moment. We definitely want to get deployment in here as well and just deploy them. Not necessarily putting on patrol, but deploying them might be a good idea. Anyway, that's where we're going to leave it for now. No one is using the showers, but that's fine. We have, oh, of course, there's no water connection to the family cells. There, A lot of things are happening in the prison at the moment, but all of them, most of them are good. So I hope you enjoyed this episode, and if you did, then make sure to leave a like and subscribe if you haven't already. And then I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye.